Skype, hello. Hello, hello. Hope you all can hear me. Let me know. Oh my goodness. It looks like we're live. It looks like we're good. Oh my goodness. Hello, Mary, Annalise, Sonia, Adri, Kevin. Kevin, you made it. That's awesome. Oh my gosh. Oh, we get a kick Bochi again. It's wonderful. Mary, Ariana, Adelie. Oh my gosh. And Leanne, thank you so much for super chatting. Oh, shaky, shaky. Super chat, shaky, shaky. We missed you last live. So I'm glad that you can make it. And thank you so much for letting me know that it sounds and it looks good. All right, guys. So as usual, if we get booted this time, which last time we didn't and I was so stoked. Um, but if it happens, then we're just going to go to Facebook and then we're going to finish it out there. Because, yeah. Oh, my gosh. Akita. Akita, you can make it. That's awesome. You took off for this? Oh, my gosh. It's freaking awesome. Adri, thank you so much for super chatting. Shaky, shaky. Oh, my gosh. What? <laughs> Cheshire, hello. Happy belated birthday, by the way. I hope it was awesome. I loved your outfit. It looks so cool. So, so cool. Oh, my gosh. Okay, guys. So, we are going to get started. It's going to be a full body workout. You know it. It's going to be cardio and strength and abs, all that jazz. Every exercise will be 45 seconds on, 15 seconds rest. During those 15 seconds, I'll tell you exactly what the next movement is. So, let's get warmed up. Started out by butt kickers. So, kick that booty in back. Drive the knees up front. And again, I went around the house and I was like unplugging everything that I possibly could and turning off all the lights. So, should be good. <laughs> should be good. <laughs> Three, two, one, and arms out, feet out, kick across the body. And really think about exhaling every time you kick across. Because you want to get that nice crunch for our core to get it warmed up. Keep it going. Oh, yeah. Ooh, I'm so excited you guys are here with me. Thank you again so much for joining me live. I can't tell you how much it means to me. It's just really cool that we're all kicking butt all across the world. And go ahead, shake it out. Circle those arms forward. Try to bounce it out if you can, but if it's one of those days, you can totally go like this. <laughs> but for me, I'm excited. Three, two, one, and bring it backwards. Big rotations, whoo, big open spaces. Can anyone tell me where that reference is from? It's from a cartoon. So let me know in the comments if you know what that's from. Three, two, one. And let's come down into a plank position. So hands right under the shoulders, press in the down dog. And when you come back, drive the knee in. So press all the way back and drive it in. So we're getting the shoulders, we're getting the core, quads, getting a nice stretch for our hamstrings. There's a lot going on. <laughs> Two more. Last one. And let's go ahead and go into side planks and keep alternating. Kevin, you can do this one now. It's so exciting. Kevin's shoulder used to be ickies, and now it's so much better. It's so exciting. Whew. Let's go three more. Last two. No, one more. And nice job. Go ahead, flip it around time. We're gonna have our hands in back of us. I like to have my arms out into a seal for this one. You're gonna press yourself up and reach. So we have reverse tabletop reaches. Really push those hips up and keep changing the directions that you're reaching. So you can reach behind you, you can reach the side of you. Just keep pushing those hips up. Go two more after this one. Up. Last one. And nice job. Go ahead, come down the ground. Let's get that core. So legs at 90 degrees. Go ahead, tap and reach for the heels. Now, if that's too far for you, you can go ahead and plant your feet and just, just reach. Might be a few back farts here. <laughs> Let's go two more. Last one. And roll back. Reach through. Roll it back, avoiding that head and that neck. Make sure you tuck those knees in. Woo! And up. Let's go two more. Up. Last one. Up. And then come back up. Ooh, shaky, shaky. Let's go ahead and stabilize on our right leg. Drive your knee up. 
From your kick, bring it back. Stabilize, bring your left leg back, kick. And let's go one more time on this leg. So we're warming up those stabilizers. Front kick, stabilize, back kick. And let's go ahead, switch legs. Woo! And knee up, front kick. Lean forward, hinge from those hips, back kick. So remember to keep your chest up, back flat. Last back kick here. And nice job. Woo! Let's finish with some skaters. So side to side, you can walk these out if you need to. Or you can tap the ground. If you're feeling yourself today, you're feeling pretty good. Get that heart rate back up. Still working stabilizers. Oh, baby. All the way. Let's go four more. Last three. Two more. Last one. All right, guys. So go ahead, grab a drink if you need it. I'm going to check the comments just to make sure everything's okay. And then we're going to get started. Paul, oh my gosh. Thank you so much. You're a changing lips. Thank you so much. Shaky, shaky, super chat. Oh, I appreciate that so much. Thank you. Thank you so much. I went full Asian on you. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, your sister is Adri. Oh, I love Adri. <laughs> and Stephanie, hello, hello. Oh, I'm so happy you got to make it. It's so fun live because you get to see all my goofs happen as they happen. <laughs> all right, guys. So, oh, there we go. <laughs> 15 seconds, three skaters, back lunge and hop. So, we're gonna go one, two, three, stabilize, back lunge and hop. And then the next time around, you should be on the other side. So three, two, let's go. One, two, three, stabilize, back lunge and hop. Keep it up guys. One, two, three, up, back lunge and hop. Keep rocking it guys. Remember, if you wanna make the skater harder, tap the ground, but very lightly. One, two, three, up, back lunge, and hop. Remember, you can take out the back, or not the back lunge, the hop out, and just make it a calf raise if that's best for you. Whew. 10 seconds. Two, three, back lunge, and hop. Three, two, one. Okay, so. Next up, what we're going to do is come back into that plank position, like the warm-up. You're going to bend the knees, press back, come forward, side plank again, just like in that warm-up. All right, let's go. Press back. So bending your knees like that just acts as a really good reminder to make sure whew, that you press back. So we're getting shoulders here. We're getting core. So we're doing triceps. Keep rocking it. Press it back all the way. 20 seconds. Keep going. Hopefully you can't hear my computer fan too much. <laughs> Sometimes it likes to get noisy. Up and press. We're going to go back to cardio after this. I know you guys like that format. Three, two, one. All right, so next up, two frog pulses, 180 jump. So toes are gonna be facing out, keep your chest up. One, two, jump. One, two, and jump. If the jump is too much, come to the tippy toes. All right, let's go. So, one, two, jump. Remember to keep your back flat. Try to get to at least 90 degrees with the legs. If you don't have like a mirror, like all these mirrors, <laughs> um, you can always set up your phone in selfie mode and then check your form. One, two, and hop. Keep rocking it, guys. Hop. One, two, land soft. Protect those joints. 10 seconds. Yay. One, two, and hop. Five, four, three, two, Fun. You guys like yoga? Because we're going to do some yoga. So, warrior three. What you're going to do is stabilize on your right leg. Bend that knee slightly. Warrior three. Come back. Figure four squat. 
Let's go. So, reach forward, come back, stabilize, figure four. Now, if you can't do the figure four, instead, you're gonna do a curtsy, okay? So, keep going. I'll demonstrate the curtsy after this. You bring your leg in back, sink down, keep your chest facing towards me, so we're really getting those glutes. Whew. Fitness is not just strength and cardio. It is stability, coordination, mobility, flexibility. This is getting a lot of that right now. Whoop, Andrew Pinchy. Three, two. Okay, so before we go to the other side, we have to have cardio. Sorry, I'm not sorry. Okay, come into a plank for grasshoppers. So you're gonna step your foot to the outside. One, two, three, four, all the way down, up, and burpee. So, one, two, three, four. If you don't wanna come all the way down, you don't have to. You can just jump back up. One, two, four. Whew. Oh, that's fun. <laughs> One, two, three, four. All the way. And press. Oh my goodness. One, two, four. Over halfway. And up. One. Real light on those feet. We got five, four, three, two, and done. Okay, hopefully you remember which leg you're stabilizing on. Whichever leg doesn't hurt as much. So for this one, it might be more challenging just because our heart rates are up, okay? So take your time. There we go. Okay, let's go. So, warrior three, stabilize sink down. That side's tighter for me for the figure four, and that's okay. But I'm not just gonna brush that off and be like, oh, it's just always tighter. No, I'm gonna work on it. And if you've been following me on Instagram, you see that I've been doing hip opening exercises every day. And it helps so much, because it's not just about doing the splits and stuff, but about getting deeper in movement and using the muscles you're supposed to be working because they're not too tight. Whew. Okay, hook skips, coordination, and cardio. So what you're gonna do is hook across the body to the opposite side knee and skip. If you can't get this, you're gonna go like this and I'll tell you when halfway is. But you can also walk it out. Keep it up guys, hook. This one's awesome because we're getting the core as well as cardio. <laughs> Why not? 30 seconds. Nice job, guys. Back to strength. After this, keep rocking it. We're strong. Hiya. Finish it out. 12 seconds. That's nothing. It's nothing. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay, so movement flow. One of my favorite movements. Feet out wide. You're gonna plant your right hand. From here, you're gonna kick your right leg through. So stabilize, don't collapse in that shoulder. Come up and up. Let's go. So this is strength. This is mobility, flexibility, Coordination, balance, why not? <laughs> and as you get better, you'll probably be able to go a little bit faster, but some of you might get stuck here. So use your other hand to help press yourself up if that's the case. Then you'll build the strength. Just remember, if you see me do a move you can't do now, don't use it as a way to get sad about it, use it as motivation. Like, that move is possible, and I can build up to it. Uh, can I stay here? No. Okay, box formation, high knees. So you're just gonna move in a square. High knees forward, high knees to the side, high knees back, and over to the side again. Okay, pump those arms. We're 
always moving in different directions. Mine is more of an oval. <laughs> Just like my face. That's more of a circle. I don't know. Keep going. If you don't have room, just do your high knees in place. Keep it up, guys. Whew. 20 seconds. Hey, guess what? You're really strong. <laughs> you can move the other way if you want to. But yeah, just remind yourself, you're strong. You got this. Three, two, one. Oh, dumbbells, they exist, I forgot. <laughs> Narrow to wide rows. So I'm gonna grab that weight with my back flat. From here, push your hips back, lean forward slightly and bend the knees. Narrow, wide. Let's go. Squeeze the shoulder blades together. If you just wanna stick with a narrow or just a wide, that's okay. If you have really heavy weight, you can do one at a time. That's okay too. Remember to row back towards the hips. It's not, it's not um, out like this for the narrow, okay? Whew. I just remixed. It's not, it's not. <laughs> Squeeze the shoulder blades together. It's so important to work your back because that helps with posture. And with good posture comes good health. Three, two, one. Oh, yeah, it's enough weights. <laughs> okay, two plank, jack shoulder taps, and then an in and out. So come into a plank. What you're gonna do here is tap, tap, drive in, and back. Let's go. Tap, tap, in, back. After a while, you'll get the flow of it, or you won't, and it'll take some more time, which is okay, especially if you're doing this after the live because you can just rewind. If you have a time turner, you can also rewind. <laughs> Modification, tap, 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 and tap. That's it. <laughs> keep going. Try to keep those hands under the shoulders. Five, four, three, two, and done. Oh, so that's fun. That's really fun. Ooh. So next up, back to that curtsy. If you didn't do it before, here it is. Keep your chest forward. Curtsy. From here, stabilize. Standing splits. And then front kick. So more stability here. Curtsy, same leg. Bring it down. Leg up, standing splits. Front kick. You should really start to feel this in your glutes. Nice stretch for your hamstrings. Woo. And uh, stay on that same leg and kick. Oh, I'm shiny today. <laughs> so sparkly. Real light when you do those standing splits. And whoop, and kick. Oh my goodness. Okay, so you know what? <laughs> We're gonna come down. So you're gonna have your hands to the outside, jump over so they're still on the outside, bring it up, donkey kick. <laughs> Cat, what the heck? <laughs> what the heck? You're welcome. So, cool part, we're using a lot of body weight here. So if you're ever like, I'm traveling, I don't have my equipment, I can't work out, guess what, you can. You're welcome. Now the more you do that donkey kick, probably the more comfortable you're gonna get, and the higher you can bring your legs. Oh my goodness. Quads are definitely feeling this. Oh, fun, 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 fun. Three, two, oh, shaky, shaky. Good thing we're doing like a leg kind of thing next. <laughs> oh, cat, you think of everything. <laughs> How do people with really long hair work out? I don't get it. <laughs> okay, let's go. 
I hope someone compiles just all of my random thoughts. And kick. It's not stoner thoughts, it's just cat thoughts, which pretty much sound the same. <laughs> and um, and kick. Keep rocking it, guys. Uh, raise it. And kick. 15 seconds. Then we're gonna go and do some cardio because I heard you like it and that this wasn't enough. Whoops. Four, three, two, one. Okay, four jump rope kickouts, double under. So you're gonna act like you have a jump rope. Kick, one, two, three, four. Really jump up there and move your arms like a double under. Pretend you have a rope. Okay, let's go. One, two, three, four. Whee! <laughs> I feel like Mario. Woo! Wah! Or like Yoshi when he's like, mm -hmm. <laughs> keep it up. Mm -hmm. And I got the cheeks. Got the same cheeks as Yoshi. Watch, I'm gonna have flagged for that because it sounds like it. It's one of my childhood talents. The only thing that impressed guys. <laughs> Whew. Three, two, one. <sighs> yeah. Okay. So that was fun. Oh, you know what's really fun? I put a cardio move after this for some reason. Sorry. So one, two, three, four, five. Stabilize. Single leg. And up. So two, three, four, five. Stabilize. Single leg, tiptoe. Three, four, five. So, I mean, kinda cardio. <laughs> five. Keep your chest up, keep your back flat. One, two, three, four, five. Whoop. And remember, if you goof, whatever, it's fine. No big deal. We don't have to be these perfect beings all the time. That's not the point. Woo! One, two, four, five. We're allowed to be goofy. Whee! Three, two, one. Okay, so now we're doing, now we're doing strength. <laughs> so let's come down, tricep push up, elbows in. If you need to come down the knees, you can. From here, push up, walk it up into a pike, walk it back. That's it. Okay, so it's quite a bit of core. You might not be able to have your legs super straight, but try as best you can to keep them as straight as possible, as possible. Remember to look a little bit ahead of you for those push-ups. Make sure you're not chickens. No chickening. Triceps, shoulders, chest, abs, hamstrings. <laughs> Keep going. Ooh. Almost there. Three, two, one. If you can't do that, make sure you work on your hamstring. Oh, what is it called? Flexibility. That helps a lot. What are we doing? Okay, so one, two, three, burpee. Whatever kind of burpee you want. Okay, one, two, three. Oh, this floor is gonna get super slimy. Keep going. Up, jump. Don't forget to jump at the top, mainly because it's fun. <laughs> and that's a burpee. Up, one, two, three. Remember, it's a short workout, so just give me your all. Just try your best. We're almost to car, or almost to cardio, almost to abs. Whew. Oh, baby. Ten seconds. One, two, three. Up, up, up. How fun. Oh my gosh. Okay, so I'm gonna grab a weight from here. We're gonna go back into those side planks, but you're gonna raise it up like you're pulling a bow. So you're gonna go up right next to the body, bring it down and switch. Up, 
right next to the body. That's gonna protect your elbow, your shoulder, so make sure you're not bringing it out. We're getting shoulders. <laughs> They're getting core. Woo. Stability. Up. And then after this, we have all core. So we're kind of doing a nice transition where it's strength and core. And so, I thought that was clever. <laughs> My cat, sometimes you're clever. Three, two, one. And then Jurassic Park music plays. Okay, so we're gonna come down. Support your lower back, bring it up, down, open the feet. Okay, now if that's too much, bend the knees and bring it up. And make sure you have all the back parts. If you're slimy, and you're shirtless, it's probably going to happen. <laughs> there it is. Now, notice how I don't have my hands supporting my lower back. That makes it more challenging. So if you want to make it more challenging, try that. It'll probably increase the ratio of back parts to not back parts. <laughs> oh my gosh. Keep going. <laughs> and up. Give me a break. I'm vegan. <laughs> and up and reach. Whew. Keep rocking it, guys. Whew. Oh my goodness. That was fun. Okay. This one, you might hate me, but it's okay because it's only for 45 seconds. So you're going to do bicycle feet and you're going to crunch up and down. If that's too much, plant your hands in back. If that's too much, bring out your legs and drive a knee up. Okay, let's go. Okay. I can take it. I'm strong. Keep going. Ah, there's a hair. Okay. Breathe. I keep going. Oh my goodness. I'd like to thank Jeff Cavalier at athletenuts.com for this one. <laughs> I always like to learn all the things from his channel. Mainly like whew, biomechanics stuff. That's really good to prevent injury. Three, two, one. Okay, so grab your weights. Look, we're actually using our weights, guys, I swear. So you're gonna come into a plank, bring it to the outside of your hand, then you're gonna grab it with the other side and bring it to the outside. Try to keep your hips from swaying and keep going. You can come down to the knees, just make sure your hips aren't up. Push your hips forward and you'll still be working your core. You can also separate your feet wider for more stability. Keep your neck neutral. Ooh. This one's really good. I really like this. It's, it's fun. <laughs> you feel productive. You're like, oh, this one uh, goes over here. Oh, look. Uh, okay, this one goes over here. <laughs> Tricking my brain into thinking I'm productive. <laughs> Ten seconds. Ooh. Finish it out. Three, two, one. Oh, we only have two more. Oh, that is great. <laughs> so let's come down. Look, sweaty buddy. Legs to 90 from here. Crunch, bring it out. Crunch over to the side. Let's go. Woo. If it's too much, just keep your legs at 90 and move side to side. That's okay too. Whoa. There we go, okay. Keep using your breath. So we're getting the front of the core. We're getting the obliques as we chop to the side. Very nice. And we have one move after this. And we're gonna do our nice stretch and then midi meditation. Ooh, keep going. Oh. Oh. Almost there, guys. Huh? Okay, so last one. We've got to work that lower back. But we're also going to work the front of the core, too. So from here, what you're going to do is go with a V up, come down, roll over, Superman. Roll back. Now, if you can't do the roll, I want you to just stick with Superman.
Superman because I find right now that's going to be most important to strengthen. Try not to use your hands and your feet. This is where you get all the dust in the world on you. You're welcome. <laughs> Wee! All the way up and all the way back. Oh my goodness. Whew. Breathe. Ah, a little weight. Uh, and back. Whoop. Use my hands. I use my hands. Take me out. <laughs> 10 seconds. And back. Uh, and done. Done. I know that one seems silly, but it's a lot of core control to be able to roll. So if you can't quite do it yet, just keep on working on your core and your lower back. Okay, so we are going to stretch and then do our mini meditation. I want to thank you guys first so much for joining me. Um, it really just, again, means so much to me. Okay, let's go ahead. You guys know I've been doing a lot of hip opening. So we are going to be here, then into tabletop. From here, bring your right foot out, hokey pokey, and have your foot facing forward. You're gonna lean back now. Ooh, try to keep your foot in line with your knee. You should feel this in the inner thighs of that right leg. Ooh. This one is really nice to get started with your stretching and stuff. Oh my gosh, I'm looking at myself now on this and I look naked. Oh, okay, switch. We gotta get this over with. I swear I'm wearing clothes. Good thing for the mirrors. <laughs> Pants only. <laughs> okay, keep going. And back. The thumbnail for this one. So I really liked the picture, but then I like looked at it, I'm like, Hmm. So I messaged my sister. I'm like, does this look too fans only? <laughs> and she's like, no, don't worry about it. And go ahead, bring it back. You're going to have big toes together, knees out wide. Walk the hands forward. And then you can sway a little side to side. And then go ahead and bring your right hand palm facing up and tuck under. And then relax your neck down to the ground as much as you can. You should really feel this in the inner thighs. Those hips. And then go ahead, we're gonna switch. Breathe. So stretching's not only just good for, you know, mobility and flexibility. Go ahead, bring it up and then swivel. But it also helps to build those muscles. I know it doesn't seem like, oh yeah, but stretching helps build muscles, but it does because it Make sure everything's in line and there's not knots which can prevent that muscle growth. So keep that in mind. Make sure you're stretching. Ooh, those elongates the muscles. Makes them look nice. Nice and nice. <laughs> right leg forward. Press into it. Because ever since I started stretching, I'm seeing lines on my legs that I've never seen before. Like muscle, and I'm like, ooh, it's working. It's working. Breathe. And if you feel stable enough, what you're going to do is tuck those left toes under. Then you're going to bring your left arm up and over. If you feel really stable, you're going to turn up towards the ceiling. Reach with those fingertips so you really feel it in the side, on that left side. And go ahead, bring it back. From here, we're going to flip this. So you're into a nice calf and hammy stretch. So take your right hand and bring your hip back. Now your hip is in line instead of being here. So that's pretty cool. If you want to come down to the ground like this, you can. If you want to wiggle, you can too. Maybe not your whole body, just the, just the leg. <laughs> and wiggle. And let's go ahead and switch. Wee. And press into it. Breathe. Just think of all the stuff you just did. How cool is that? Then go ahead, tuck it under. Just like, and bring your arm up and twist if you want to. A, like, less than an hour ago. You were just lounging maybe, getting ready. And now, now you just defeated so much. You conquered so much and that's so cool. You guys are so capable. 
So let's go ahead, bring it here, left hand to the left hip and pull back so it's nice and in line. Try to have your back as flat as you can. Oh, there we go. I'm telling you, mirrors are really helpful to keep those, that, those cues. And go ahead and bring it back. Let's get the upper body a little bit. So go ahead and come back in a tabletop. Walk the hands forward, come to the fingertips and come down side to side. And let's go ahead, shift it forward. Someone requested this. I'm so sorry, I forgot who, but they're like, you guys did a, you did a stretch when Justin was there. I was like, oh, I know what you're talking about. So I'm gonna bring it back for you guys. Have your right thumb facing down and bring it right to the side of you. Now the higher your arm is up, the more challenging it's gonna be. So bring it out, left hand right by the chest, bend your left knee, are you with me? Are you with me? Okay, cool. And then bring it over. It's a lot of directions, so relax your neck. You should feel this a lot in the right shoulder. Breathe. Ooh, that chest and that shoulder, those hips. Bring it back. Ooh, go ahead and stay if you want to. And then switch if you're ready. Breathe. One side might be different than the other. This side's not as tight, so I'm gonna bring my arm up a little bit more. Oh, oh there it is. <laughs> Make sure it's not like a super sharp pain or anything. It might be pretty intense of a stretch though. So make sure you're breathing and bring it back. Hands by the chest, press up. And let's come into a crisscross applesauce. We're gonna do one more stretch and then we'll get into our mini meditation. So, Make sure you relax your neck entirely in this one. Don't let, don't let resistance come into it. Clasp the hands and then bring it back into the uh, back of the head. Elbows in, tuck the chin in the chest. Again, relax your neck as you pull down. I feel this all the way down my spine. Very gently release and slowly roll it up. Few side to sides here. We are going to end off with a mini meditation. So go ahead, get comfortable, whatever comfortable pose is for you. It can be lying down on your back. It can be here with me in this crisscross applesauce. And hands onto the knees if you're here with me. Close your eyes. You're going to cycle through breaths while I bring you through a mini meditation. So big inhale, exhale, big inhale, and exhale. So you guys keep cycling through. Recently, Justin and I were sick, so um, he was a little bit, well, a lot of them were sick than I was. And I, during that time, I was like, okay, I know I'm, I'm probably gonna catch this, whatever he has. <laughs> so I have to prepare myself. So what I would do is I would go out into nature, or you can be here with me, and I would just keep repeating myself. I'm strong, I am healthy, and I'm badass. So I want you guys, even if you want to say it out loud, or if you want to replace one of those, you can, but I want you to keep cycling through. I am strong, I am healthy, and I am badass. Keep saying that. And for me, when I would say I'm strong, I'm healthy, I'm badass, this like, it would start into the, my chest and it would just radiate throughout my body and I felt stronger. And I didn't get very sick. <laughs> so I really do believe that we have so much power over our health. So make sure you take that with you and realize that you have that power in you. So keep cycling through one more time. I am strong, I am healthy. And I'm badass. One more big breath, big inhale, exhale, open your eyes, shaky, shaky. So I did talk about that a little bit in one of my vlogs about, you know, creating your own identity. And really, once you start talking to yourself how you want to become or what you want to be, then you start becoming that. Because it wasn't until I started to really say these affirmations to myself, I really like 
felt it and I started forming my actions towards it. So recreate your identity. You do have that power. If it's like, if someone else can do it, why not you? So make sure you just remember that you have that. Think about all of the things that you did in this workout. So crazy, so awesome. How capable you are and how awesome it is that you showed up today for yourself. So really just take that in and take that with you and remember that you can do that for yourself mentally too. You can be strong, you can be healthy, you can be fit, you can be anything you want to be. And yeah, so let's go ahead and clasp the hands in front, pull the shoulders in, big inhale up, and exhale, oh, 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 oh. We are done for today, Yay! we did it. Thank you guys so much for joining me. I'm so happy it worked. Um, if you do want to support my channel, there's a link down in my description that says support my channel, or there is super chat if you're with me live. I'm going to look at the comments to make sure you guys all survived and you're all happy, healthy, strong, badass, all those stuff. So, hopefully I won't cut off my head again when I'm talking to you guys. <laughs> Yay! Okay, let's see here. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Xaviera, so glad to join in. Thank you so much for being able to make it to the live. 30 watching. Oh my gosh, that's awesome. Troy. Oh my goodness, thank you so much for joining me, Troy. I hope you have an awesome day too. Bill, oh my gosh, you made it two times in a row to the live. I love that, I love that. Young TZ, oh, watch this at three in the morning. I can't believe that you do that, and I love it. And thank you so much for coming in again. I know you pop in sometimes, so I, I just really appreciate it, and I want you to know that. So, mommy, Pam M, Pam M. That's my mommy. Hi, mommy. I love you and I miss you. I'm going to cry. No. <laughs> awesome. Kirby Bunny. Yes. Thank you so much for joining. Brett. Brett and Audrey. Audrey. I just said Audrey because I combined Audra with Audie because of Animal Crossing. <laughs> Hello. We should play Animal Crossing soon. Legit though. Because they came out with new hairstyles and you can be bald and I thought it was hilarious. That was really cool. Okay. <laughs> Mary, thank you so much for coming. Thank you. Thank you. I really appreciate all of your comments on my videos and stuff. I just want you to let you know. Adri, yes, we are all really strong, healthy, and badass, and I freaking love it. Stephanie, thank you so much for coming. Shoulder touch, plank jack straight humor in my apartment. Oh my gosh. Yeah. It takes a little bit to get those down. It definitely took me when I first learned it. I was like, uh, I'm gonna cross with a oh my god. So <laughs> you'll get it, you'll get it. Believe me, you'll get it. Bye bye, Cheshire. Thank you so much for joining. Oh my goodness. Adelie, thank you so much. I'm I hope I'm pronouncing your name right. Adelie? Adelie. I love that name though. So just so you know, thank you so much for joining. And thank you so much for your comments too. Again, I just appreciate it so much. Akita, thank you so much for joining. I'm glad you could make it. And then Brett, thank you. Shaky shaky super chat. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, or like the Animal Crossing one. <laughs> that one always reminds me of my mom. <laughs> she always does it. I love it. Kevin, thank you so much for joining. I love that I was able to talk to you after class, and that was awesome. I would love that I could catch up with you. And thank you so much for coming to this, because I know that you've just been putting so much into it, working up from three workouts to four workouts, and now maybe to five. That's great. So thank you guys again so much for joining me. I just appreciate you guys so much. Um, I will see you guys next week, 10 a.m. Central, live, hopefully, if you can make it. I hope you can. Um, that's going to be the day after Thanksgiving. So that's going to be fun. <laughs> if you guys have any requests, let me know in the comments. And maybe I will do that. I don't know. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Xaviera. Oh, my gosh. Just finished therapy session. Got to join in. Your workouts is best. They help to stay motivated and get back into it. Oh, my gosh. Fun to have your random thoughts. Oh, I'm glad you like them because I'm always like, ah. <laughs> super chat, shaky, shaky. Thank you so much. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. I feel like as the super chats come in, I have to get a little bit more funky. Actually, it just kind of naturally happens because I'm really excited. <laughs> Adelie, okay, good. I'm glad that I'm pronouncing your name right. Ariana, thank you so much. Again, thank you too um, for all you really appreciate them so much. Have a great day, Stephanie. Yes, young TZ. Of course, thank you so much for joining me during this time. I know it's crazy, but I love that you guys are taking care of yourself during this time because it's so, so important because there's a lot of things, you know, you can't really control, but there's a lot of things that you can still control. And one of them is your health and your mental health too. So don't forget to work that. Very, very important. Xavier, okay, good. I was hoping that I pronounced your name right. I love that name. Mommy, why did you name me the name that you named me? Why couldn't I be something cool like Xaviera or Adelie? 
<laughs> Regrets. Time turner. Boo -doo 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 -doo. I just disappear. All right, guys. Thank you again so much. Um, don't forget to like the video before you go if you can. Um, it helps me out. It helps YouTube see that there's more activity on the video. So it's like, ah, I'm going to show this to more people. They're stuck with her. <laughs> Kirby Bunny. Thank you so much again for the amazing workout. You've changed my life with these. Thank you. Oh my gosh, whenever someone says something like that, I start to get really emotional. So that really means a lot. Thank you so much. Um, so before I get too emotional, I'm going to sign out. Otherwise, I'm going to start crying in front of you guys. So I appreciate you guys so much. Have an amazing rest of the day. Do all the things. Roar! Roar!